Ladies and gentlemen, beautiful people, another set of loot boxes is over here. Today, I'm going to find out if those are worth it, what we are able to get and so on. I have 50 boxes on my main account right over here, which uh, was given to CCs by Wargaming. So CC RNG boosted to the absolute max, right? 50 boxes over here. But guys, I am going to do a little experiment because... I have every single tank on this account, which are inside the loot boxes, besides the new TL7. So I should be guaranteed a TL7 over here on this account. But I am going to buy, with my own money, I'm going to buy some more boxes on this second account. And I'm going to compare the difference. I'm going to compare some results. You know, the sample size is very small, I know that. But uh, it's better than nothing, let's put it that way. Anyway, let's not uh, chit-chat over here for too long time. Let's have a look what they have to offer uh, the boxes this time are called martian containers and um, article actually is not out on the eu server yet so we are looking at the asian server article uh, but uh, inside of those boxes uh, the main of course the main uh, drawing point is this tier 9 american tank destroyer auto loading tank destroyer tl7 i have a video about that already made actually so check it out link is in the description as well and uh, also uh, as a little you know fillers there are many more tanks like the chieftain prototype astron rex t77 44 uh, kv4 ktts is for the ave uh, torn one e7 5 gave you 5 like I would say definitely the the tank which you want to get the least is this torn one I would say so and maybe for some D77 as well I kind of don't mind this tank D44 100 is pretty nice uh, this is one of the newest tanks as well actually uh, in the game but uh, not too many people seem to enjoy it Astro Rex is nice Chieftain Broto is like eh, okay so not the, the most terrible line of vehicles, but uh, nothing too crazy either. So right from the get-go, uh, I can tell you that. And uh, on the top of that, there are some uh, 2D styles right inside the Martian containers. And also, uh, Days of Earth Thanks, Premium Time, Crew Skins. Uh, well, Premium Time for many of you, you know, if you purchased uh, uh, Holiday Ops boxes, Christmas boxes, this is worthless for you because you are swimming in premium days anyway so this is uh, bad for many of you but for some of you maybe not crew skins like i don't know for me garbage um x5 missions for me extremely good personal reserves credit boosters excellent right crew books of course helping it out credits filler definitely a filler right up here and the complete list of Martian container items. You can see one, three, or seven premium days, one, three, or five XP missions. I want to get those X5 missions. Those are very good, boosting your tanks. Uh, credit boosters, 500 or 250k credits. Training manual, um, one training manual for a random nation. Then we have a training manual, universal manual, 25% over here, personal training manual, uh, and also 20% probability for different styles. This is filled with uh, styles over here and uh, special, you know, crew skins as well. Uh, those uh, spaced uh, astronaut themed uh, crew uh, skins. Right, okay. Now, now after we know what is actually inside the boxes, let's uh, jump into opening them on the main account. So those 50 boxes, as I said, are provided by Wargaming. All the CCs uh, uh, received the boxes and uh, uh, the first box is already... Well, it seems to be like the previous event. Like, it seems to be like the previous event, the Shamrock Special Edition, where 90% of the boxes were pure garbage, actually. No, but, you know, like for someone like me who has over 900 premium days, I understand that everyone has it, but this is just worthless. Um, 250k credits. I would take credits over premium day for now, for example. Uh, then combat XP right up over here. Premium day and extra training, book, uh, training booklet. Are there no animations? Wait, what? Wait a minute. Is there actually not any way? Oh, by the way, again, key thing to note over here. Key thing to note over here, ladies and gentlemen. Available for purchase within 24 hours, 500. 
This is a huge boner killer, actually. I cannot actually buy more than 500. This is crazy. The crazy limit over here. I wonder if this is a bait. Anyway, uh, first uh, style over here into the space. I already have it. And three X5 missions. This is actually good, but there is absolutely no animation. No animation whatsoever. I wonder if I get the vehicle. Uh, then is there going to be an animation? Because uh, there should be... Yeah, this is the guaranteed drop, so once again, if I have opened 50 boxes or 49 boxes without the vehicle, I'm going to get the guaranteed premium tank from the list. And for me, this has to be a TL7. Okay, training. Uh, not training, sorry, credit. Uh, booster right over here. X5 missions. I love those to grind out new lines faster and field mods as well, of course. So this is a space shuttle decal. Okay, if you're into this type of stuff more uh, training books manuals Ooh, this is the maximum drop actually for the uh, 5x i like that i actually do like that booster this is the 50 percent yeah this is the 50 percent not even 100 like come on board gaming give us at least 100 percent to combat the xp booster like is it too much to ask huh those boxes actually feel lazy, indeed. No animation, no, nothing whatsoever, just a little sound effect. Oh, lag? Nah. Last time I remember the Shamrock Special Edition, the lag uh, hinted at something else, you know? But maybe this time it is just lagging. Okay, first crew skin over here, we're gonna see. Hovering over it, Pavel Budzizhevsky. This is the first crew skin. And uh, let's see how much the 50 boxes will be. How much is the 50 boxes actually purchased? Let's see. After 25 boxes, let's see. How much uh, uh, are the 50 boxes? 40 euros. Okay, so this is 40 euros worth of boxes. And I think on the other account, I, I may purchase... I think I'm going to with uh, 50 as well, but uh, we'll see. Uh, we'll see, just uh, as a little comparison, because, uh, like, on the other account, uh, I have uh, maybe only one or two vehicles from the list which they offer over there. This is a style. This is actually my second style, and the style, once again, which I already own. But the nice styles, I like those Into the Space and uh, Conquer the Stars, so those are very nice styles, definitely, I would have to say so. James Lagvik. Laggy guy, let me tell you that. Seven premium days, though. This is the maximum anyone can get. Uh, Vostok Mosaic. One premium day as well. All right. Now, if you would not have any premium days, yeah, definitely helping you out. But uh, paying 40 bucks. Like, so far, paying 40 bucks for that. For uh, a uh, premium dank. And all the other things on the side. I don't know if this has been a value. Because, you know, I'm going to get the guaranteed premium tank anyway, right? Uh, so basically, you have to think 40 euros to get a premium tank guaranteed. But you don't know which one you get if you do not have those. Any of those, for example, you don't know which one you get. If you get the, the torn one, well, you are going to curse. Because that tank is actually, actually way too slow for... Uh, today's meta. I'm getting the same. I'm getting duplicate crew skin even. Okay, maybe I'm able to... <clears throat> maybe I'm able to make entire crew looking exactly the same. Alright! So box number 40 was my first premium tank. Uh, basically, so running slightly above uh, average, because the average is 50, 2% chance, you know, makes 50 boxes on average, and I got TL7, and no, <laughs> no animation whatsoever. I, like, I remember in the last event, there was on the bottom left, there was a show animation or disable animation option, but right now, nothing, nothing. Nothing at all. Okay, so TL7... Here it is, right? With uh, 40 boxes. But you can have 
50 boxes luck and get something else as well. Just, you know, just as, as an example. But let's keep going. Let's open 50 boxes over here. 250k uh, credits, premium days. Uh, we get the boosters. We get uh, another premium day. We get uh, trading manuals. I would, yeah, I would take the X5 missions over premium days for now, you know, in this specific situation. But next time, guys, next up, I'm going to open those boxes on an account where I actually want premium days. So let's see. Anyway, uh, roughly, what was that? Roughly 30 premium days received. Yeah, I remember 400, uh, uh, sorry, 947, 46 I had before. Let's take a quick look at the missions. Uh, let's take a quick look at the missions, how many X5 missions I received. 24 X5 missions, so I'm going to get 5x experience every single battle after the first daily double is done. And a couple credits, and of course this tier 9, uh, uh, where is this TL7 premium tank as well. I'm going to, I guess, uh, I, I said I have a video about this already, but I'm going to make another one uh, for you as well, most likely, so stay tuned for that. But now, let me quickly, through the magic of editing, flip the accounts, buy some boxes for you, and let's see what we get over there. And by the way, another thing to note over here, I can see 50 boxes and 75 boxes, uh, well, they have the same box price, but you just get more X5 uh, XP missions over here, so I'm going to buy this, and uh, let's keep in mind that I have 55 XP missions, uh, you know, already on the side. And uh, just like that, Wargaming is the real winner over here, as always. Alright, no matter how lucky I get, no matter how lucky I can be, Wargaming is the real winner. So, we have 50, let's see, 28 million credits, uh, 50 um, X5 missions, and 4 premium days. And on this account, I actually want to get premium days. And on this account, I think I only have E75 TS. And I do not have T-77, okay. So two tanks, and I think that is it, if I'm not mistaken. So all the other tanks are going to be in the pool. Uh, let's see, 50 boxes coming up over here as well, with no animation once again. So training books, uh, okay, boosters. Actually, you know, may need those, 63 on this account, uh, let's see, nothing to do with CCRNG anymore, hopefully we are, <clears throat> hopefully we are more lucky, ladies and gentlemen, and also Fyodor, different uh, uh, crew skin as well, I got duplicated crew skins, which sucks, I hope the, I, I hope, well, I can't do anything about that now, but I hoped you cannot get duplicated crew skins at least, but you can. So, that was actually very lucky. Fourth box and one vehicle. Let's keep going. Let's get back-to-back -back action over here. So, this could be my only tank, actually. Because now the next guaranteed is out of, the re out of reach. 250k credits. I had roughly 28 million, right? A lot of boosters, a lot of boosters, and nothing on the side. So not rolling the 20% drops very often. Minimum, 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 minimum. Not minimum, middle. Okay, at least double drop over here. So is it worth 40 euros? If I get another premium tank, you know, if I roll the dice correctly, if I roll, like, let's say, seven, two times in a row, and get two premium tanks out of 40, and all the goodies on the side, definitely, then, yes, premium day. And on the account where I actually need premium... Min, 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 min. Okay, so half box is opened, four premium days. 1 mil credits and some X5 boosters uh, missions. Alright. And of course, KV5 as well. Did I have KV5 before? I, I didn't have KV5 before. Chat, you're drunk. 
Okay, let's keep going. Boom! Wait. I didn't have this tank as well? Okay, I guess I didn't. So, I do not smell DL7. So, once again, if you don't have most of the tanks, be ready to get something random. So, DL7, I don't know, does it have extra chances to drop or not? Well, so far, we have not hit that. Um, actually, we have uh, Wargaming in the chat as well. Dweaked, does DL7 have extra chance to drop or not? Boom! What the hell? I'm going to make this account. My main account, because this seems to have CCRNG. This is actually an account which Wargaming has nothing to do with it, okay? <laughs> uh, by the way, Wargaming tweaked said TL7 and Chieftain Broto has higher chance than other tier rates. Okay, higher chance than other tier rates. That is rigged, that is rigged. Even Wargaming is saying rigged right now. You see? You see that? You can't see that. God damn it, you can't see that. Okay, anyway, just believe me. Um, Chieftain Brotodub, that's actually third premium tank. But guys... <coughs> what the... <laughs> what the hell did? What the hell did? I can't release this video right now because this gives, uh, this gives false information, ladies and gentlemen. This gives false information, ladies and gentlemen. How can you get four tanks? How can... And two tier nines, two tier eights. How can you do that? How? Ladies and gentlemen, keep in mind, it's all down to the RNG. Previous 50 boxes opening, I got one guaranteed tank. And now four. Why stop here, right? Why not five? Why not five? Huh? Credit boosters. X5. X5. Well, now, now, basically, now it doesn't matter anymore. Now it doesn't matter anymore. Hey, Wargaming, did you boost wrong account? You have no idea about this account, actually. This is my secret, papaya brain. Okay, four more boxes. One more premium tank. Maybe two. Okay, you are leaving two last... Oh, this... I didn't get that style on the other account. This is actually nice. New style. New. On the other account, I got only duplicate styles, which I have had for years. Like the uh, Conqueror Stars and whatever, or... Something like that. Okay, two premium ranks coming up. Never mind. And never mind. And again, different style over here. So, uh, pretty freaking crazy. That was actually pretty freaking crazy. TL7, IS3A, KV5, and the Chieftain Prototype. Um... Yeah, if uh, if your luck is like that, yes, boxes are worth it, but guys, your luck can be worse than the previous 50 boxes I just opened. So it all comes down to the RNG, keep that in mind. And never, I cannot emphasize that enough, I cannot put enough exclamation marks behind this. If you don't have most of the tanks, let's say... All the tanks besides like two, or maybe even only TL7. And if you want to get one specific tank, never chase that from the loot boxes, from the Martian containers. Never do that. Never, ever. Because you may get premium tank only with your 50 boxes, and you can get something completely random. Never do that. Keep that in mind, but, you know, I made this video just to show how stuff is looking like and what you can get. So basically I got um, 13 premium days, uh, 2 million credits, and uh, how many X5 missions over here? 26 X5 missions, so more X5 missions as well. Because I had uh, 50, and on the other one I did get um, 
24 if I remember correctly. So yeah, uh, ladies and gentlemen, beautiful people, chat. What do you have to say about that now? Pretty crazy CCRNG, right? Pretty crazy CCRNG was this one right over here. Uh, CCRNG, yes, hell of a strong CCRNG, but you know, this all, all jokes, ladies and gentlemen, all jokes and uh, giggles, whatnot. Anyway, now you know this is an alien. Wow, why? Now you know, let me know what you think about that. If you're going to buy something, tell me why and how did you do, right? But once again, other than the tanks, like if you want to get the tanks and you do not get uh, more than one, are all the other things on the side worth it? In my opinion, honestly, not that much. Especially for more veteran account who has a lot of boosters already, who has a lot of crew books already. There are a lot of uh, stuff what you are basically never going to use. But, you know, at the end of the day, I am not your accountant, your mom, your dad, your financial advisor. You know better. Have a good one. Take care and bye.